Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be my melting basket. I did go live because for some reason my phone wasn't letting me um, film, so I went live. However, I deleted that video and um, I added some more stuff because I just got a Scentsy order. So I'm just gonna redo it all. So this is going to be my melting basket. The first um, item I chose, and if you guys do not know, I am a Scentsy consultant. My links will be down below. I would love if you join my team. Um, this is Ocean, part of the Bring Back My uh, Bring Back My Bar collection. I have this in my Scentsy Club. It is a nice aquatic uh, scent. I'm also going to melt Lemon Thyme Berry. This is a nice lemon and berry scent. And I do have a couple items in here that are from last week. This is watermelon mint. I do have this in my Scentsy Club, and I have a couple bars on backup. However, I am going to melt it and see if I want to keep it in my club. Um, oodles of orange. This is a nice orange scent. Don't worry, you guys. I have also vendor wax in here as well. Um, happy new home. I was going to keep this one and give it as a gift, but this one came like, there's nothing wrong with the wax and it is still sealed, but since it came like that, um, uh, here Frankie, hold on. Um, I'm going to go ahead and melt this, but this is like a, um, and this is part of the new collection moment by moment collection. I have several more of these bars coming. And this I would put in as a laundry scent, laundry clean scent. And here is the scent of the month for August, a sneak peek, vanilla blackberry. And I think this smells like Post Malone's cologne. It smells good. I'm going to melt that actually when I get off of here. Um, this is from Rainbow Melts and Beached. This is... Uh, fizzy pop saltwater mermaid and beach type. I've already cut it up and I'm excited to melt this. I really, really like um, rainbow melts. This is um, Troppy Chunks and this is Tonka Ode. Ode? Ode? Whatever. <laughs> this is a nice woodsy, smoky scent. Yes, with a tad bit of like a cologne manly scent. And um, Palo Santo by K's Wax Melts. I already cut it up into four melts. This is a nice Palo Santo scent. Um, I got some Love for Fat Wax in here. So Green Apple Essence Fizzy Pop. I did go ahead and cut it in two. This is a nice um, apple-y scent, but it's almost like um, Coke, like, fizzy coke apple scent this is salty sea air baja cactus by love fat wax i've already cut that up i'm not too sure on this one i'm not sure if i will like it it, it may not be a scent for me but my son really likes it frankie so i'm gonna melt that for him and then a, a love fat wax acaya berry and it is just a true berry, blueberry scent to me. And fruits, melons, and berries by Love Fat Wax. And this is a lighter one, so I did not cut it. I will melt the entire thing. And it smells, well, just like what it says, but I don't get a berry note on cold, but it's more of fruits and melons. Um, and then Mac Apple, just a nice apple-y scent. They cut it in half because I do plan on mixing it. Here's a wax that I made that I'm just testing out. This is Chicks and Wicks. I did melt it previously. I saw that I melted one or a piece of it, so I did pull it out so I can melt the rest. 
This is called Best Friends. And this is a nice scent. This is actually sent to me. And it's like a nice cherry, sweet, candy, delicious kind of scent. Um, Candles by Victoria. Baby's Breath. I did already cut that up in fours. Uh, Rainbow Melts, Honey I Do You, Honey Do Melon, and Cotton Candy Frosting. Like I said, you guys, uh, I'm loving Rainbow Melts. This smells really, really good. You would think it was like really, really light, but it's 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 really not. So um, I'm going to melt that. It's a sun, so some of it broke, but um, I already cut it up. I'm going to melt that in two warmers. Um, Pink Zebra. I pulled out, so this don't have a label because I had cartons of it. This is pure or pomegranate, so I'm going to um, melt that. And this one um, from Pink Zebra is California Boy. So I really like this. This is like a um, clean. I'm going to melt this one in the, the bathroom. It's like um <sighs> clean body wash, manly body wash kind of scent. And Frankie is going to let me melt this. This is actually his, but he let me choose one of his waxes to melt this week. And this is Birdie's Making Sense, Strawberry Jam, Fruit Loops, and Sweet Strawberry. That was because that was her favorite out uh, of the wax. So yeah, this good. is Mommy's favorite, so he treated me. I'm going to love melting that. Um, in my collection, again, I had a half one, and this is um, the Melted Mousse Banana Pudding and Sugar Cookies. This smells like coffee to me, so um, I like coffee, but I'm I'm gonna but I'm gonna melt that and then choppy chunks coconut mango. I figured I better melt this before I get too far into fall. Mmm. Probably gonna melt that in my bathroom. And I pulled out Better Homes and Garden by the pool. This lasts for days. Days and days and days. This is from Walmart. You wouldn't think by smelling it on cold, but no, it's a powerhouse and it lasts for days. I really recommend this one, stocking up. And then I pulled out Super Tarts, Parker, Strawberry, and Lollipops. I'm probably going to mix this one. Um, it smells a little... Um, it's because of the packaging. I swear these clamshells ruin her wax. Yeah, it smells a little plasticky to me, but I definitely don't want to waste it. Um, I am going to try it first, just melting it. Um, out of all the bars that I've gotten with her and these clamshells, only one has not smelled plastic. So, uh, yeah, I, I definitely think it's this packaging. Um, but I, I have stuff to mix it, you know, so it's not going to go to waste. I'm going to try it out. And then, um, I'm going to keep in my melting basket, Hayden Row Chilled Sangria. I didn't go through all of it. So, um, it's like a nice, it, it, it's got a grape note to it. Yeah. So I like that. And decided to keep it because that would be great to mixing um i never got to this last week so i finally melted some last night this is strawberry bubble gum and um so last night it was crazy i did not smell it for like an hour and i had this on a hot plate warmer did not smell it then when i was ready to lay down go to bed Oh my God, my whole room was strawberry bubble gum. So this took a while to give me the scent, but when it did, it was good. So I'm keeping it um, for this week as well. Irish Lennon from Kay's um, Scented Melts. This is a nice, strong, clean scent. It smells like Irish Spring Soap. And I put this in my living room and kitchen to get out some smells from cooking and OMG, it smells so good. So, I, as you guys can see, I have, like, a, a wide variety. I decided to keep this in just in case I wanted, like, a clean scent. And then um, I did go through some of these. But this is from Tropy Chunks, and this is Guava Splash. As you can see, I went through some of this. And 
this is a nice tropical scent. I wonder if he has the scent notes on here. No, he don't. But um, it's just a, a, a uh, smells like Hawaii. This wax vendor um, is from Hawaii. So love it, love it, love it. And then uh, keeping with what I didn't get through was Blue Grotto. And I only have two left, so it didn't make it to my empties. But um, so I wasn't like a huge fan of this. I, I didn't jump on the back bandwagon. Then I pulled it out to melt in my melting basket. OMG. Nice citrusy scent. I am now a fan. I love it. So... And then this is the scent of the month for July 2021, Stargazing. As you can see, I still have five left because I keep forgetting this to me, for me anyways. It's not for everyone. But this is, I associate it with a nighttime scent. But it has like a, a, a vanilla woodsy note to it. And I like it for nighttime, and I keep forgetting to put it in. But I really, really like this scent. Not a lot of people do. And then I just pulled out a car bar to put it in my husband's car. And a peeling apple. And you guys, that's it. That is my melting basket. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I cannot wait to watch a lot of your melting basket. And if you don't have a YouTube channel, let me know what's on the chopping block or melting block for you this week. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. My links will be down below. Bye!